This is Commando on the Acorn Electron and believe me I had a bitch of a time getting this thing to load. I probably just wasted 45 minutes trying to get it to load from tape. Anyway, it's not a review, walkthrough, playthrough, anything like that as usual. It's just me playing the game badly so you can see what it looks like and I will predictably talk rubbish all the way through it. Uh, here goes nothing. Don't know what the controls are. Okay, that seems to do that. That does that. What fires? Return. I'm going to guess space bar is grenades. I mean, this <laughs> is really, really slow. Commando was always, I mean, it was never a fast game. But I remember playing this back in the day, um, and I was fairly used to it being slow like this. And I, I played it. I had a friend round who had an Amiga. This is before I got an Amiga, and he was horrified at the speed of it. You know, said, "Oh my God, I could write something faster than this using whoops, basic." And because I was so used to this, I didn't get it. I thought, it's not that slow, that's just the speed the game runs at. But looking at it now, it's shockingly slow. I think the 2600 version is quicker than this. I shall, have to, I shall run a link from that to this. So that... Uh, anyone who wants to can compare them. I am playing this with a keyboard, I'm not, I, I don't have a joystick for my electron. I, mean, I suppose that there is an advantage to it running this slow in that you have time to think about where to run to avoid the bullets, but I, I don't think that was... Uh, I don't think the original arcade game gave you that much time to think about it. You could almost write a written report on where you're going to go. Stop and have a cup of tea before that bullet hits you. Quick, walk, there's a bullet heading towards you. Walk for your life. That reminds me, that there's, a, there's an episode of Invader Zim called Walk for Your Life. And this kind of reminds me of that. There was a bullet heading towards me there, but I was able to run in front of it. Mm. Perhaps I'm Neo. That'll be it. The, uh, was it the Wachowski brothers will have, uh, I don't know if that's how you pronounce their name actually, but anyway, yes. Those brothers who made the Matrix, they were, they'd been playing this when they came up with the idea of, like, the agents and all of that lot moving. Well, slowing everything down to dodge the bullets. This is where it came from. <sighs> Does that want to chuck a grenade? I guess that's not not the key to do it. How do you lob grenades? Don't know. Okay, it's shift. <laughs> Crazy. 
I lost me key. Are you still awake? Are you still watching? <laughs> Why? This guy's fallen asleep leaning against the wall. There we go. The funny thing is, even though it is so shockingly, ridiculously slow, I like this. I shouldn't, I really shouldn't. I should be saying, what a load of rubbish. But I like it. I think it's got a certain comedy value. boxes of grenades up there. Oh yeah, these doors open and a bundle of people come flying through. This is one of those places where you need to use grenades. I think it's not so much on, on this bit. You don't so much uh, die through being swamped with enemy as you would on the arcade original so much as you, your keys your controls slow down so much that you go into a coma there yeah he's fallen asleep that's gonna have to do I mean god it's any of those of you who were reading War and Peace when I started will have finished by the time I get halfway through, so, um, you know, kind of look back. No, I'm stopping, that's enough. I mean, there are only so many jokes you can make about it being really, 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 really slow. And um, I might run out by the time I'm finished if I carry on. So this and game videos of games that actually are games and, you know, you could read the program code quicker than this. No, I'm labouring the point. Videos of other games in my collection and a video of my console and computer collection can be found on my YouTube channel. <coughs> Excuse me. There's a link there and somewhere on here to my website, uh, retrogamingcollector.com. So take a look at that if you haven't fallen asleep. Thank you for watching.